the bar one handicap chase is next up then and a smaller field for this one about eight or nine i think it's only two miles it's a naught to 140 and the top one is maximus galacticus for paul rhodes first 11 darren thompson tenable express for david robertson sea view pretender thomas rogers shogun leon van rensburg mary storm craig beckwith Tushuk Tash, Vinnie Gerard and Paul O'Neill's got the bottom two, Belladonna and Golden Charmer. A different Belladonna to the one that won the Oaks on day one. And as one of them's a flat horse, one of them's a jump horse, they're not going to clash, so it's not going to be a problem. So ready to go then, and off they go. Pressing down towards the first fence, and Maximus Galacticus in the white jacket. Probably just about the end. Nothing seems that keen to lead. They've got ten fences to take in this two-mile race. And first eleven might be just in front as they pass the winning post with a complete circuit to go. And finally sort, sorted themselves out. And it looks like Belladonna might come through to lead. A lot of those horses in those colours like to lead and they're all over the first okay and now they're racing away from it towards the second and it is Belladonna for Paul O'Neill in the lead then Tenable Express for David Robertson is second and first 11 on the outside for Darren Thompson with Maximus Galacticus for Paul Rhodes on the inside as they take the second and there's a faller there Mary Storm has gone so Mary Storm's a faller I think that might be Craig Beckwith so bad luck there make their way towards the next and Belladonna will lead over the third good fast jump got away from it really well looks like Paul O'Neill's going to be leading down at the back marker at this stage he's got Golden Charmer at the back Belladonna is setting the pace to the race as they take this ditch and over that one they all go and Seaview Pretender in the green on the outside the green in between there is Tushuk Tash and slightly different patterns but they're both Two shades of green, aren't they? Touch up Tash for Vinnie Gerard in second. See if you pretend I think it's Thomas Rogers on the outside. Maximus Galacticus, Paul Rhodes. First 11 for Aaron Thompson as they take the next one. And then Leon's gold cap on the outside for Shogun. And Tenable Express for David Robertson in those turquoise and purple hoops. The golden charmer bringing up the rear then so they're inside the final mile now and this is the sixth fence and they're all safely over that one and they've only got four more to take and Belladonna is three lengths clear of Tushuk Tasha Maximus Galacticus a mistake there by first 11 moving up nicely around the outside is Shogun and Belladonna's in front pace is considerably quicker to what it was early on Tushuk Tash second Maximum Galacticus and then Tenable Express first 11 recovering from that mistake Shogun is still going well the one that's just dropped off the leading group a little bit is Seaview Pretender as they take that next one and Golden Charmer is probably the only one totally beaten at this stage but Belladonna is now being pressed by Tenable Express and first 11 and Shogun round the outside and suddenly it's all changed they take the second last one as a faller there Belladonna's gone so the long time lead is out of it and Tenable Express is in the lead from first 11 second Shogun third and then Tushuk Tash then Maximus Galacticus Seaview Pretender trying to run on he could see any of these six winning but Tenable Express is the current leader they've only got one more fence to take but they've still got two more furlongs to race and Tenable Express on the inside of first 11 Shogun powering down the outside of the track Maximum Galacticus is trying to run on Tushuk Tash is looking a little bit wind pace now as they take the final fence and first 11 got away from it well Shogun made a mistake it's first 11 now by length first 11 from Tenable Express it's surely between these first 11 races into the final half further looks strong enough to hold on it's first 11 a good two lengths clear now and racing up towards the line. First 11 takes it from Tenable Express and then Shogun and Maximus Galacticus and CV Pretender next. Push up Tash drops out of it and Golden Charmer was the last one to finish. And it's another one for Darren Thompson. And he takes it. With first 11 despite a couple of mistakes in the race. Shogun another one who surely threw away his chance with his jumping. But it's first 11 the winner for Darren Thompson, Tenable Express for David Robertson, second. Shogun for Leon Van Rensburg, third. Maximus Galacticus, Paul Rhodes, fourth. And Seaview Pretender for Thomas Rogers was fifth.